So this is day three, and we have taken a car, and we'll be exploring North Goa. As of now, what we have decided is like we'll go to Chapora Fort, and we'll be there for some time. And since we have a baby with us, this baby with his granny. Uh, so we don't know if it gets very uh, sunny. Then we might come back and again go later. But as of now, we are going to Chapora. Uh, so we are taking a uh, Swift Desire. Uh, this is off season, but it, they are uh, they don't uh, give cars for a single day. So after a lot of requests and all, we got for 12 hours, and they are charging 1400 rupees. But uh, normally they prefer to give car for multiple days. Like you come here, you book a car, car for like two three days for your whole stay. Then it gets cheaper. For us, it got a little costly. But fun is fun. You have to pay for it. self drive and google navigation that's the best way to explore goa the roads are really good for a drive The fort closes at around 5:30 so entry is restricted till 5 pm The present fort in Chapora was built in 1780 The fort now is completely in ruins but the view is amazing from the top The climb is really steep and on a sunny afternoon it's quite impossible So try to go in late afternoon time. Once you go on the top, you will find two beaches, Vagator on one side and Morjim on the other.
you is to die for. It's too good. decided to go to Sinquarium Beach at night at 8.30 but um, he did not fall asleep so I did not want to go without him sleeping before that because he will fall asleep at any moment and anyway the whole day it was very hectic for him so I decided to take some time off this journey and relax with my baby here my husband and my brother they went mm. to Sinquarium and they have to drop off the car also because tomorrow we are anyway leaving. And now I'm just relaxing with Mr. Archie and after some time I will feed him again and then I'll go out for dinner. Mwah. Say hello Archie. Wow. the last day and uh, we are having our breakfast and Archie is chilling out like a boss looking at the beach this is first beach experience I don't think he'll remember anything but this video will help him out <laughs> As 
this is the last day i am going out to get some uh, uh, you know, souvenirs from goa for my family but since it's morning not too many shops are open but whatever is open i think i can do with that while returning back to bangalore we took the train the train cuts across western ghats and you get to see the famous dud sagar falls but as we went in the month of april there was hardly any water you should come just after the monsoon it will be really good <laughs>